Hi. Do you know someone with a bitchy face? They look like they're kind of thoughtfully sad or angry for no reason. Oh look! That woman has a bitchy face. I wonder why. I can't see a reason why. That's bitchy resting face. That's bitchy resting face. That's bitchy resting face. But here's a surprise. Those women might be suffering without you even knowing it. They might not even be bitches at all. They might just have faces that to you look bitchy. So bitchy. And they are suffering silently. And we should know. I've got bitchy resting face. I've got bitchy resting face. I... You know, I'm not a bad boyfriend. Just tell me what I'm doing and I will stop doing it. This is the first relationship where I'm really trying. Do you get that? Okay, your receipt is in the bag and eight dollars is your change. Thanks. Um, okay. Emily, will you marry me? Yes. Oh wait, no. Oh no, 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 no. But you don't have to run from this problem. You can think, hey, that woman might not be a bitch at all. That might just be her bitch face, and that's okay. Because for every woman suffering from bitchy resting face, there's this. Hi, I'm not an asshole. I just have an asshole face. As many men suffer from resting asshole face, if not more than women who suffer from bitchy resting face. I'm not an asshole. I genuinely want to buy you a drink. I don't want to fight you. I couldn't be happier to earn a living in customer service. Please excuse my asshole face. So if you see someone with a bad look on their face... You don't have to bother them. You can just leave them alone. Because it might just be their face. And if it is their face, they probably already know about it. So there's no need to point it out to them. Because they have feelings too. Because if we wanted to be constantly misunderstood, we'd try and talk to a deaf person. Hey, Taylor, we... I think you might actually be a bitch. Like in real life. Yeah. That was... You should have all been aborted. Whoa. Oh. Bitch! Hey. Okay. Okay.